But yeah, there's a lot of endogenous tryptamines that modulate consciousness in ways that we do not fully understand. Even melatonin is something that I think could have some very interesting effects on either dreaming or all sorts of different aspects of waking consciousness. And melatonin is very closely related to a lot of these serotonergic tryptamines, even though in and of itself it is not a hallucinogenic drug. But if you just reduce one of those oxygens and you have, then you have and ethyl 5 methoxytryptamine, which is hallucinogenic. So it's very, very, very close to some known hallucinogens. And, uh, and yeah, this is really something that's worth investigating because, again, these are almost certainly modulating our waking consciousness in one way or another. Yeah.